here with Concordia head men's soccer coach Jason Lightus after a 1-0 win over Bellevue. Uh, a hard fought game and it comes down to a, a PK that you're able to convert late in the game. Uh, you fought off a lot of corner kick opportunities that, that Bellevue had. Uh, what did you see from your guys and, and what did you learn, I guess, in that seeing them able to pull this out? Yeah, I mean, we, we did joke with the team that we defended 48 corner kicks today. It felt like that. I don't know how many they had. It was, it was certainly a lot. Um, but I think what we learned about the team a little bit was um, that we can get better throughout games. We, we really weren't very good in the first half, minus the defensive side of the ball, the transition side of the ball. Uh, without the ball, we, we did the work in the first half. But with the ball, man, we, we really struggled in the first half. And I think it was one of those where... We were maybe a little overhyped for the game, a little tense, and Bellevue came out flying, and they, they were playing really well in the first half. And, I mean, ultimately, they, they were preseason number 12 for a reason and made some good runs in the national tournament. They're a good team. Um, and uh, It's one of those where in the second half, it felt like we really started to come alive, get on the ball a little bit more. In the first half, we just could not stream more than three passes together uh, outside of one or two opportunities. And I think we only had like one or two sort of true opportunities in that first half. So I think we just got better throughout the game. And the guys really uh, made some good strides at halftime. And we created nine shots in the second half. And just created more chances in the first five minutes of the second half than we did in the first 45 combined. So I thought we showed just great growth. and. Um, so some composure throughout the game overall we showed good composure in a, in a game that where it's physical and intense uh, you know decent amount of fouls I mean we didn't probably end up with too many fouls we didn't end up with too many cards uh, I thought our guys showed pretty good composure in, in a heat intense moment minus the end uh, a little emotion there at the end and we, we need to be better at the, those very waning moments at, at the end so we're not picking up cards that are gonna gonna hurt us uh, but uh, overall I think the guys showed a lot of grit today, and uh, you know, it was a hard-fought win, 1-0 against a good team, and I was, I was pleased to see us not provide them many great chances. I mean, yes, they had chances, but not many great ones. And what's the significance of, of winning a, a, a close battle like this? Um, it, that's maybe a hurdle uh, that you had to clear from a year ago, and, and uh, I'm sure that's a good sign as you get closer to, to conference play. Yeah, ultimately, I mentioned Bellevue's a good team. We're going to face other good teams, and this type of game prepares us for what those are like. When you're, uh, whether it's the prettiest game in the world or it's the ugliest game, uh, you've you got to be willing to battle and scrap and win second balls and do all the little things well. And I think today we, we learned how we can do If we do that well, we're going to be in probably competing with anybody. But uh, you just got to do that each and every game because we're going to have a lot of tough competition coming up, especially once you get in GPAC. It's, it's not going to be easy for any game. So I'm, I'm really excited to see us take on that new test each and every game. Um, but I think the goal is that we keep on improving. It's nice to be able to learn a lesson, improve, and get a win. Uh, that's, that's what we really want to do.